from oh no to whatever. August 29, 2016. Dear ones, perhaps you feel deflated by not sensing anything extraordinary or as you might say, woo woo, during this energy season. Your concern is that you are not progressing as you wish, or that you cannot progress because of something you have not cleared or have not done that others seem to do automatically. None of your worries are accurate. You are accepting the new energies of this strong eclipse period as fully as anyone. It is just that you have less to address, or the energies are not those required for your expansion into new you. Your path is unique. So it is with energy bursts. You will collect those pieces of any energy burst most appropriate for your being. You fully accept that those beginning their transition will have different reactions to energies touching Earth than is true for you. And you accept that energies introduced to Earth, remain of the Earth to be accessed when appropriate. Yet, you fear that somehow you have once again done something wrong, for you are not feeling the depth of shift that others are reporting. You are not them, and they are not you. For those who have cleared your 3D baggage, your transition is no longer a group transition. But seeing so does not necessarily make it so for you. So it is that many of you are wondering why you are not sensing anything unusual. Granted, perhaps your sleep patterns have shifted a bit. Or you feel nauseous or something similar that could as easily be the result of eating foods you are not accustomed to as a transition symptom. All the while, you read of or listen to those who experienced almost surreal symptoms of visitations in their daydreams to physical ailments so deeply defined that they have difficulties completing their daily activities. What about me, you cry to yourself. Am I not worthy? Have I done something wrong? Have I forgotten or neglected to clear an important piece? All indicators you do not trust yourself, most notably for this time, you do not love yourself to allow you to be you. That phrase, allow you to be you, is key to your transition. You are not like anyone. Therefore, you can no longer expect to react the same as others during any energy burst. You are comfortable being like everyone else, yes. I think I felt something too. But not so comfortable stating, I'm not feeling much of anything, but that's my truth. So it is you are learning to accept yourself in totality. Some of you have and will experience deep shifts within your being. Some of you will not. Materials about how you should and will feel are no longer appropriate. You might experience the internal shift so many are now discussing in your dream state. You might have already completed that phase. Or perhaps that phase is not that important to your transition at this time. You are truly a unique individual and far enough along on your path to not worry about accepting an energy burst at the same time as others, or ever. Unique means unique. Accept and flow with the shifts you feel. Ignore what others are telling you that you should or will feel. Never again will you be part of the crowd while of Earth in this lifetime. You may be experiencing certain energy bursts, or not. But neither experience makes you less of a new being, merely a unique new being. Much as traveling across the United States from the Atlantic Ocean to the Pacific Ocean on back roads versus interstate highways does not create a different destination, merely a different route. Access those transition materials you feel personally drawn to, and ignore those telling you what you should feel. You are you in all your glory. And yes, your internal being is shifting as is your external being, your perceptions, and your reactions. But they are your shifts, and will occur in a way that is right for you. Some of you will experience those shifts with great discomfort, physically or emotionally. Others will breeze through various energy bursts only to be surprised by a seemingly lesser energy burst, or not. You are a unique individual. Think of those of you who have great difficulties with certain birthdays, and others of you who do not. Your unique shift is no different. You can set yourself up for a painful experience or one that is just part of the experience, another perceptual shift that is a function of new you, from oh no, to whatever. And so it is. Channeled by Brenda Hoffman. www.lifetapestrycreations.com